entitlement. Still good. Okay. Bear with me here real quick. I've got a bit of a zoom in focus problem that I plan to rectify. We can get started. Terraforming Mars. Um, let's see, I need to see that screen. And we're gonna move this. Round one. Doing a quick check on this camera. Get my way. There we go. Okay, so that camera is gonna work. Um, this is Terraforming Mars. We're gonna run this solo version. Um, don't have a lot of table space. Let's get the all cam view up there. All cams, all cams are go. Okay, mm -hmm. I do have to um, draw my starting corporations here. I am also playing with the prelude expansion because I heard it helps a lot. So I just gotta quickly shuffle all of the corporations without any of the beginner corporations. Um, oh, and I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to seed the board with um, two cities and two forests adjacent to each city, and that's a really interesting thing to do. Um, and I, I do that before choosing my corporations. So here's how you choose the cities. Um, you choose the first city. The cards all have card numbers somewhere. Uh, and I don't quite know where the card numbers are. But according to the rules, either way, um, it looks like it's there. It looks like card number 102. I'm not counting 102, so let's just use the last number, 2. Um, and I go top to bottom, left to right like you're reading. So 1, 2. But since that's an ocean space, I put it in the next available slot. So that is city number 1 that nobody owns. And then I take another card, and this one's card number 203, and you go backwards from the bottom this way, so it'll be one, two, three. Another city will be there, beginning of the game, also that nobody owns. Um, now we do forests, and you're supposed to count, we'll just do odd, even, odd, even. And this is a odd number, so it's gonna go here. And these also do not raise the oxygen level, according to what they said. And this number is 30 or, or 5. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and place it there. So these are, are what start in play. Um, we only have 12 rounds. So the solo game is a little bit different. Whoa, I don't know what happened. Lost my screen. Um, sorry. sorry about that. Um, we only have 12 rounds to get this done. And all we have to do, it's not about scoring. There are some variants about scoring, but we have to get the oxygen full and we have to get the planet fully heated and all the oceans in play in just 12 rounds. So now that we have, um, now that we do have the board in play, uh, hold on one second, is there a question? Oh, I'm not worried about that. As long as we can see. Oh, got it. Okay, perfect. Sorry, guys. I had to switch from my normal studio. My computer literally crashed two hours ago, and it will not start up. My other computer. And so I had to do this makeshift studio in here. Um, also, we got to figure out if they can hear us. Yeah. By the way, if you can send a note to somebody, just ask them, hop on, and say, yes, you can hear me. No, you can't. Um, that would be great to know sooner than later. In the meanwhile, um, I am supposed to add these cards. Oh, I get dealt four of these prelude cards, and I pick two. So i got to shuffle them up real quick. Um, somebody's here. Hey, Puma, you're here. Can you hear? 
Now that you're here, can you hear us? I'm going to make sure that the audio is good before I get too far going. Like last week, it was a, a hot mess at the beginning anyway. Okay, so Carrie, there is a couple things you can do. Scroll up real quick and on the audio, down, down. There you go. Oh, that's all the way up. So there's a gain button next to the red light to your right hand. There's a red light by your right hand, by your right hand. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> there's a gain button. Go ahead and turn that up, 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 up. Okay, so we're going to leave it there. Leave it there and see if uh, well, that's peeking. They'll see it peeking into the red. So, hey, listen, Carrie. Mm -hmm. Slide the audio input capture down some. Slide it down right there. Okay, a little more. Okay, a little more. Thanks for helping us tweak this, by the way. So, yeah, you want it just breaking into the yellow, but not hitting the red. And thank you again, Puma. Um, all right, so I'm shuffling these prelude cards. I have not played with the prelude expansion yet. I heard that it really helps the economy go quicker. If you've ever played Terraforming Mars and you've played the long version, you know how long it takes for you to get some, some game going. So give this one last shuffle here. These are the prelude cards. And I get dealt four and I pick two. Increase your heat production three steps. Increase your titanium production. Remove five mega credits. Place two ocean tiles. Gain six titanium. Reveal cards from the deck until you have revealed two space cards. Take those into hand and discard the rest. Hmm. I think I'm going to do heat production. I'm going to do heat production. And hmm. and then I'm going to take Galilean mining. All right, so here's the deal. What we're doing. We are terraforming Mars. Uh, it has zero oxygen right now, and it's negative 30 degrees Celsius. We're trying to heat up the planet. We're trying to get it oxygenated. And we're also trying to field some man-made oceans. Do you think if I could turn it up a little more? It's not that bad. Yeah, we can't. Um, our audio is spiking almost into the red if I go any louder than this. Uh, so sorry, Puma. Um, yeah, I just don't know how else to, to get this audio in line. Um, okay, back to this. So oxygen. Heat the planet, get the oceans in place, and that's what we got to do. But I only have 12 turns to do it in this solo mission. So I will get some of these cubes out here. Oop, too far. Gotta get, gotta get the money. Ten fives and ones. Yeah, you can hear it great. It's going to pick it up and feedback. Okay. Right now. Oh, and I have, a, I have to pick a starting corp now. I get two corporate cards. Keep one. And that's who I am. So let's see what they are. Helion, you start with three heat production and 42 bucks. I may use heat as money. That's awesome. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to go with Helion for a lot of reasons. You start with 47 bucks. Action, spend four bucks to increase one of my lowest production one step. Oh, wow. Huh. That's really good. Hmm. But heating the planet is good. But that's only one thing. This thing gives me lots of things. I think i got to go Robinson Industries. All right, I'm going to show you guys this. 
hopefully cam card will come through cam card or card cam we have a card cam cam and it is right there I start with 47 dollars or mega credits and on my turn I can use four mega credits to up any one of my productions so round one here we go first thing I do is uh, I have zero production I have zero iron zero titanium zero plant production there's a board off to the side that you kind of can't really see I don't have enough room in my camera in here to uh, set this up but that's the way it goes I'm going to play my first starter card which is Mohole. It says gain three heat production and gain three heat. So I increase my heat production by three and I gain three heat. So I'm excited about that. I start with some heat. And then the second card I'm going to play is Galilean Mining. I gain two titanium production, but I lose five bucks. So instead of having $47, I now only have $42. 10, 20, 30, 40, 2. Okay. $42 to spend. Now I get cards. And we're dealt we're dealt 10 cards, and you have to pay three bucks, three mega credits per card that you want to keep. So I'm going to get my 10 cards. It is a bummer that you can't see that. We're not on the right table. <laughs> Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, got my 10 cards. Now this usually takes a while to, to figure out which cards you want to keep, but realistically the real expensive ones aren't worth keeping at the moment because it's hard to play them. Um, I'm definitely going to keep this one. Once I pick the cards I'm keeping, I'll share with you why and what they are. Um, this one has requirements to play that I can't meet, so that's the first thing you look for. Um, let's take for example, I'm not keeping this card. If you can see the requirement somewhere up top, it requires two oceans in play. There aren't any oceans in play. Um, that's what those two water symbols are up here next to the 12. So since I don't know when those will be in play, I'm not going to pay money to keep that card. Um, I might keep that one. Um, Definitely keep this one. Where's two power tags, huh? Hmm. Don't know that I want that one. I do like that. I do like the comet. You don't need anything that says your opponents cannot do something to you. One, two, three, four, five. So I think I'll keep these five cards, discarding the rest. When you discard in this game, discards are done face down. Um, I don't really know why that is. I'm sure there's a reason. I'm sure some people smarter than me know that answer. And if you have any questions, uh, Carrie can read them out loud. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So 20, I get five back. Someone says, good to go now. Okay. Well, on your turn, you get to do two things. Of those two things, here's there's a list of seven or eight things you can do, but you can only do two. Um, right here is you can sell cards, one card for $1. You can buy a power plant for $11. You raise your energy production. For 14 mega credits, you can raise the planet's temperature by slamming into an asteroid. For 18 mega credits, you can buy an ocean. For 23, you can buy a forest. For uh, 25, you can buy a city. Each city you own raises your income by one. Oh, by the way, my income starts. I forgot to put that. 
for solo players. If you don't move, like that corner of the board. Which corner of the board? That yeah, I will absolutely need it because it's my income. Maybe it's going to be I, hey, I wish. <laughs> I wish I could show everything. It's a big game. Um, I just don't have it. So the first thing I want to do, oh, it's cost nine to play this card. But I have to do it. I'm going to play this card. I can't see the card cam. Is it? No. All right. Adapted Lichen. So it costs nine to play it, and it gives me one income plant. One plant income. So every turn, I can cost me nine. So there's ten. I get one back. Um, and I raise my plant income or plant production by one. On my turn, I can spend eight plants and put down a forest. When you put down a forest, you raise the oxygen. Uh, my second thing I want to do. Let's see. I'm going to make sure I keep all the cards that I played in play because the little symbols mean something. I'm going to play Technology Demonstration. I believe. Just wondering if I start at 20. I know like the players usually start at 20 income. And I, I left the rule book in a different room. So I'm going to start at 20 because I'm pretty sure you do start at 20. This is how long you get to play the game. If you use the prelude expansion, you get two less turns because it's supposed to fast track you. Okay, I'm going to pay five for this card. And card cam says... Make it closer. There we go. Technology demonstration. Cost five. It lets me draw two cards. Uh, cards cost three each. So instead of paying six, I get to pay five for two cards. So I get two cards. Now that's the end of turn one. Um, so we're on to turn two. And believe it or not, um, I have 20 income, so I get $20. I get to draw uh, four cards. Oh, I also get one plant and three heat, because that's my production. Um, so I get to draw four cards, and again, I have to pay $3 to keep any cards that I like. Oh, boy. Um... So I kind of like that. Or processor. Um, increase your energy production by one. And your steel production one step each. I really like that. Things that increase your production levels really help you out long term in the game. What? I said you need to take a high off of four. <laughs> I think I'm going to keep those two cards. Oh, and I gained two titanium. Hmm. Let me ditch that one. Okay, I'm going to keep these three cards paying nine. So I'll pitch ten, get one back. Let's see if I can make something happen here.
I don't know. But I can't barely hear you. Because you're faced the other way. Instead of on the other room, you I face know. me. I don't know. Um, okay, well, I guess we'll start raising the temperature. Boy, I don't know how this is going to go. Um, this is really, really difficult solo, guys. Um, increase your energy production and your steel production one step each. I think I'm going to do that. So my first action is to pay 12, 10, 11, 12 to increase my energy production and my steel production. And the second thing I'm going to do I don't have that to do it. I don't have the money for that. Well, yeah, I might. Okay, let's do this. Imported hydrogen. Playing this card. I gain three plants or three microbes or three pets and I get to place an ocean tile. So I'm going to pay, it's cost 16. I'm going to pay two titanium, which lowers it by six, and then pay 10 mega credits. I'm going to gain three plants bringing my total to four, and then it's going to let me place an ocean tile. I will place it here. The board shows here that I get two plants for placing it here, bringing my total plants to six, almost enough to place a forest. Um, that raises my TR rating one for placing an ocean. Uh, TR is terraforming rating. TR uh, also sets my income round by round, which speaking of rounds, that's the end of round two. We will be on round three. And I draw four cards. I'm not keeping any, I don't think. It's got to be a really good card for me to keep it. I just don't have the money. This one requires a tag I don't have. This one requires three. Yep, I'm not keeping any of these. I gain 21 income. I gain one iron, one, two titanium, one plant, and three heat. I have enough heat now to heat up the planet. One energy. Okay, get to do two things. Um, so let's do this. Let's play asteroid card. Cost 14, and I'm going to raise the temperature one degree and gain two titanium. I can remove up to three plants from a player. I'm not going to. Cost 14, so I'm going to spend six titanium and then eight dollars. It allows me to increase the temperature and then. That gives me a TR rating. And then I gain two titanium for playing it. Next thing I'm going to do is spend eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm spending eight heat to heat up the planet again, raising my TR again. And those are my two actions taking us to round four. Four more cards. I hope they're helpful. 
because I really need some help. I'm going to keep this one, the giant ice asteroid. Not this one, it's going to be a long time before that happens. Um, search for life, maximum 6%, spend one credit and reveal, and discard the top card of the deck if it has a microbe as science resource here. Hmm. Nope. I'm going to pay six to keep these two cards. I gain 23 income. 20, one, two, three. Spending six to keep these two cards. I gain one iron, two titanium, one plant, bringing my plants to eight. <clears throat> one energy, three heat. Oh, that unspent energy turned to heat, so. Okay, here we go. Turn four begins. Um, my plan was to hit the planet with a giant ice asteroid. Look at this card. This is crazy. Cost 36. I can lower it for titanium. I have four titanium. Four times three is 12. So it costs me 24 mega credits. And I get to raise the temperature twice and put two oceans in play. So raise the temperature once, increases my heat production and TR. Raise the temperature again, raise my TR, place an ocean here. Generates two plants, raises my TR. Place another ocean here, generates two more plants. That was a big card. Uh, raises my TR. What's that? Yeah, for sure. Um, I gotta get this heat all the way up here, but I got the rest of these oceans played and I haven't touched oxygen yet, but I do have uh, plants now. I can spend eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight plants to build a forest. And I will build a forest here. And I get to claim it for what it's worth. Uh, that raises the oxygen, raises my TR. Um, and I claimed it where I get two plants back, so that's kind of nice. But that's the end of this turn. Um, you play an Earth? Hmm, that's interesting. Didn't think about that. Okay, we're on to turn five. How quickly we go through these turns. A R R A I A L. I'm being asked how to spell a game, by the way, guys, for those of you that are just hearing me randomly spell stuff, like I've got a nervous tick. <laughs> I think that's a good card to keep. How many active in one? Is that kind of thing? A uh, three. keep these two cards. Generate 28 income. 10, 20, 5, 6, 7, 8. 
one more iron, two titanium, one plant, one energy, four heat. Paying six to keep these cards. Turn five, here we go. First thing I'm gonna do is pay seven to play Flooding. It just lets me place an ocean tile. And if there's a tile adjacent to it with an owner, I can pay $4 to remove that ownership. So it costs seven to play it. And I just get to place an ocean tile. I'm gonna place it here. You know what? Yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna place it here where I get two cards for placing something here. It gives me free card draw. Hopefully they're helpful. That's a good one. But I don't have seven science tags for it, so that's a bummer. Uh, but I do raise my TR for that. And then I'm going to spend eight plants. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oops. Eight plants to play another forest. And it's going to be here. Gaining two more plants back. Raising my TR. Claim this forest for Spain. And that's turn five. I just don't see how this is going to happen. Oops, turn six. I got to face you guys, not me. Turn six. Um, draw four cards. I mean, I guess I'll go through this deck of cards like crazy. I'm just saying what you want. Yeah. Oh, yeah, thank you. <laughs> I do need to raise that O2 a lot. Okay, I'm gonna keep this card for sure. This card. Hmm. Oh, that requires a lot of oxygen, okay. Okay this card for sure. So, six dollars for those two cards. Three, six. Production is uh, 30. 10, 20, 30. I gain one iron, two titanium, one plant, one energy, and four heat. Okay, it's time to start building some cities so that I can increase my income. It's going to be a slow slash quick turn. So the first thing I'm going to do is play this domed crater. Oops, card cam. This domed crater. And it lets me gain three plants, put down a city, I lose one energy production, and I gain three mega credit production. Leave that there for a second. And hopefully one day it will focus. <laughs> Can I move it closer? Yeah. Okay, there we go. Um, so it costs 24, but it's a building, so I get to lower it by my iron to four and then I'll spend 20 credits and I get to place or I gain three plants and then I get to place a city um, 
I'm going to place it here and gain two plants because the icon on the board was plants. Lower my energy by one and increase my money production by three. That's my first action. Second action is to lock the dogs in a cage because they're just barking. I don't know if you can hear the dogs or not. Um, second action, unfortunately, is pay 11 here to raise my energy again because I have another card that requires it. And that's it for turn six. On to turn seven. <sighs> Draw four cards. Look through them. Oh, yes, I know this. It's tough. I'm going to keep this card for sure. And then I'm probably going to keep... I think that's it. I think that's it. Okay. Uh, that cost me three. Income is 30 plus three, so 33. Um, one iron, two titanium. One energy. One plant, four heat. I have a lot of heat. I need to heat up this planet. Um, okay. First thing I'm gonna do is build this other city. Where'd it go? Or should I just heat this planet up twice? Let's do that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Yep, let's do that. So I have eight and eight. So I'm going to heat up the planet once, raise my TR, and raise my heat production because that's what that does. And then I'm going to heat the planet up again, raise my TR. That's turn seven. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong or not. Again, I've never played this solo. It sure seems hard. I'm on turn eight, which is evidenced by this marker here. Um, four cards again. One, two, three, four. Let's see if any of these are help. I don't need to increase my money production anymore. Yep, yeah, none of these are good. I need to be placing lakes, placing forests, like whatever cards allow me to do that, like this comet. Okay, so I'm keeping nothing of those cards that I just drew. I gained 35. Nobody's not sure how to get past it. Yeah, I'm not either. Gained 35, 10, 20, 30, I mean, if you're five. rounds, that's one round. But you have oh, I'm hip. Um, but see, you can do things like this. Um, first thing I'm doing is playing this comet. Can't see. I get to raise the temperature and place a lake. Cost 21. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's 15. Um, 15 and 6 is 21. So I get to raise the temperature, raising my TR, and place a lake. And I'll place it here to get a free card. 
see if it's anything that does something like that. Nope. Okay. Then Anything else? Oh, spend four energy. I don't have four energy, so I can't play that. Wow, okay. So I can spend eight, two, four, six, eight plants to place another forest. Here, getting two more plants back and raising the oxygen level. That's that turn. <laughs> turn nine. I gain 33, so, I mean, I have a ton of money because I'm not spending it on anything. Let's see what four cards I get this time. One, two, three, four. Nope. Increase your energy three steps. That could be helpful. I mean, not. I don't think it's that helpful, though. Okay, uh, let's just ditch them. Well, I'll keep that one. That it lets me increase my energy three steps. Cost me three bucks. Keep that card. I gain an iron. I gain two titanium. Five heat, one energy, one plant. Mm. Okay. So, I mean, I can also just straight up pay this costs to add forests, add whatever. But it's better to do it from card effects or what have you because you can kind of combo it and do two things. So, I guess One, two, three, four, five more forests will automatically raise the temperature. Wow. I don't I don't can see you it. Start buying it. I don't see it. I just don't see how I can see in the game when you're playing with other players, they're helping raise temperatures and and do this stuff too. Well, I'll keep going to turn twelve just to see where I get. Um Just hoping one of these cards in my hand would help me play something extra, but they don't. So I can pay twenty three. Can we play this? Not sorry. <laughs> <laughs> or pay, pay eighteen to build an ocean. Here gives me two plants. Three, four, five, six. Um, pay twenty three for forest. Here. Oh, raise my TR for the ocean. And then I played a forest here, which raises oxygen in my TR here. And that's my two actions. So we're on turn 10. Time set for more play. Hey. Solo play it is. Well, I'm playing solo. I'm not playing so well. <laughs> Um, 
None of these cards are good. Toss those by the wayside for turn 10. Oops, we're on turn 10. Production. I get 35 plus 3 is 38. I'm saying it's a fun game to solve. Man, I okay, I'm with it. But like I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Because I've got uh I've got a lot of money. I've got a lot of energy. I mean sorry, I got a lot of heat. I've got a lot of plants. I just can't move the needle. Do you typically make it to turn twelve? Do you typically terraform Mars by turn twelve? It says yeah on the last turn. <laughs> Okay, well, so you, have you done it with Prelude? Because I'm playing with the Prelude expansion, which says I have to do it to turn 12. I'm betting I could have had it done by 14. Hmm. I only have three more oceans to play, so that's nice. So, Dive, can I only increase the temperature one step per action, or can I pay like 16 on one action and 16 heat and do it twice? I'm super curious about that, because it's like I can't get this engine going. That's a, um, just did it on the base game. Okay. Well. And here we go. Um, so let's play this giant space mirror. Check this out. Oops. The giant space mirror says gain three energy. Yeah, it is. So gain three energy production. It costs 17. I'm going to 3, 6, 9, and $8. And I gained three energy production. So I did that. It's my first action. Second action. Two, four, six. I don't have enough plants, so I'm going to buy an ocean. Two back. Place an ocean here. It gets me a plant. And TR. And we're going to go to turn 11. Draw four cards. Guy says it's like a multiplayer game where you're allowed to do as many actions as you can or want to. Wait, so I don't just get two actions? I missed that when I was reading through the rules earlier. What have you been doing, three? Two actions. Do I have to redo this whole thing? Actually, I actually have enough money I could probably win with unlimited actions. Keeping one card costs three. Production, 36 plus three is 39. If I'm unlimited actions, I'll tell you right now, I could probably pull it off with the amount of money I have. <laughs> so do we know this to be true? No, it's buried upstairs and I'm way down here and tangled in cords in my not normal studio. Man. Oh, silly me, he's right. No, he, per turn. Yes, you're or right, you're right, you're right. Oh. Your <laughs> I, I, I can't believe I've been doing that. Oh, man. Okay, well, I'm going to have a heck of a couple of turns here. Um, so here we go. Let's play Protected Valley. Check it out. 
$23. It's a building, so it's lowered by my iron cost. I get to raise my income by two and place a uh, forest. Uh, that says um, they can check the rule book for Christmas address. No, you're good. I f you're absolutely right. I forgot. It's two per, per turn, not per round. So until you're out of money or stuff you want to do, you're absolutely right. I can't believe I didn't remember that. 23, so 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. So that's 12. I need to pay um, 11 more dollars, 10, 11, to get this. I get to raise my income by 2 and place a forest that's normally set for an ocean. So I'll place it here and get a uh, oxygen and a TR rating. <laughs> oh, that's so ridiculous. Okay, spend 13 on a um, ore processor. Check this out. Four energy to gain a titanium and raise the oxygen. Four energy, gain one titanium, and raise the oxygen level, and raise my TR. Oh, oh boy, I can't believe I've been doing that, <laughs> starving myself all these turns. Okay, well then, let's pay eight heat heat up the planet one raise my tr let's pay one two three four five six seven eight plants it was a uh, it was miserable it looks very good. play this here which raises the oxygen here and my tr here okay what else interesting can i do That's too expensive. Um, might as well do this now. Check this out, this investment loan, since I only have two slash three turns left. So I pay, oh, sorry, pay $3. I lose one income production, but I gain 10 income right now. Well, I don't have 10 turns left, so might as well play it. Cost $3. Lose one income, gain 10 mega credits. I'll buy my way to victory. So, this is fun. I'm going to. Um, I'm going to sell some cards. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Selling nine cards for nine income or nine mega credits. Can I serve? Can I? Can I re? Like, what's the word? Can I re? Uh, energize my my game here. Redeem myself. That's the word I was looking for. Can I redeem myself in these turns? I have a lot of money. I have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 99 mega credits because I've not been taking my turns. Um, the best thing I could do right now is spend 23 of them to place a forest. And that forest is going to go here, which gives me a plant, which raises this and my TR. This triggers raising the heat index one, which raises my TR. Oh man. Um, okay. Now I just want to hit the planet with an asteroid for 14, which raises the temperature, which raises my TR. Um, dives are good luck charm, man. It's looking a lot better. <laughs> um, 
Let's hit it with another one. 20, so I get six back. Yeah, raise the TR. How many times can I do this? Uh, one more for 15, I get one back. Raise my TR. See, I wanna play this ocean for free. Um, okay, I'll do one more. 14, this, raise my TR, because I'm gonna get a lot of money next turn. Okay, I think, well, no, there's no reason I should not buy an ocean. Okay, buy an ocean for 18. It's 20, I get two back. Buy an ocean, put it here, get a plant. Okay, I'm out of money now though. I have two bucks left. Look, I'm quite the spending spree. Okay, we're gonna go to turn 12. And I think for this sake, I'm going to go to turn 14 since I haven't taken turns <laughs> most of the game. Um, four cards, one, two, three, four. I gain 46 plus four, I gain 50 income. Two titanium, one plant, four energy, five heat. Don't need that. Well, this is our future depends on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Increase my heat production, gain three heat. Does that help me? Three, eight, four. Not really. Well, one, two, this one does. Keeping Heather and imported GHG. Cost me six dollars to keep those. Okay, you'll see what they are right now. Imported GHG. Increase my, it costs seven, but it's titanium based, so I can pay two of those and one buck. I can actually, I'll throw all three, I don't care. Um, increase my heat production one and gain three heat. Then I'm paying six dollars. Ten, get four back. For Heather. Check this card out. Can't see. Increase my plant production for every plant tag I have. I have three plant tags. That costs six, which I already paid. One, two, three, and gain one plant. Okay, now I need to pay eight heat for raising the temperature, raising this. Um, pay 11, no, 14, 10, one, two, three, four. 14 mega credits to raise the temperature, raise this, place the last ocean uh, here. It's the last ocean spot. Oh, no, it's not. But I'll put it here for two iron. 
Um, <laughs> dived in, dive town, and yeah, you can mark it with a you can mark it with a silver cube like this. <laughs> okay. Um, I do have twenty three to place another forest. Gotta happen. This forest is gonna go here. Giving me one plant. And raising the oxygen and raising my TR. But alas, that is like it again. So we're on turn 13, which I don't have a card for because I didn't prepare for that. But that's okay. You can see this now. <laughs> Dive four more as president. 54 income. It's pretty funny that I'd be crazy. I'm glad you saved my hide here. 54. Four cards. Could use some better cards though. I'm drawing nothing here. Okay, I will keep Mangrove for three dollars. And I will play Mangrove as my first action. Has to be four degrees or warmer. Oh, it's not four degrees or warmer. Oh, I didn't gra grab my the rest of my income. Hold on, hold on, hold on. One of these, two titanium, four plants. That slides over to heat, four energy, six heat. Okay, I can make it four degrees or warmer though. Eight heat, heat up the planet, get a TR. Two, four, six, it's not enough heat. Okay, I have to hit it with an asteroid. 10, 14, hit it with an asteroid, go here. Now I can play Mangrove. Check out this card that I can't see. You have 24, 24 anymore. Well, two aren't mine. They start in play if you use the Prelude expansion. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I have eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I, I played a card to raise oxygen one. Um, but I just played this card, which says, place the greenery tile in an area reserved for an ocean. There's only one of those left. Ignoring all placement restrictions. And I get to titanium for that. Um, which raises oxygen one more step. Here's a question. It says place a forest and raise oxygen one step. Now that happens when you place a forest. I'm wondering if I'm supposed to raise oxygen an additional step, but it doesn't say additional, so I'll just not. Okay, what can I do here? Uh, I can put another tree because I have eight plants. I have 10 plants, so I will place another forest here so that I get two plants back. Uh, raising oxygen. It is super close. Wow. Um, so 14, so 28, I'm gonna spend 30 two back just to hit this twice that's for the two that's the tree and the tree so huh I'm too I'm sh too shy or I don't have enough money to place another forest so 
I just need three oxygen some way, somehow next turn. But I will say I would have had a much better go with this <laughs> if I remembered that I had unlimited, not unlimited turns, but turns limited to my economy, for lack of a better word. Um, that's all. That's all I can do. So let's go to turn 14. This is the last turn of the game. Gain my income before I forget. 56 plus 4 is 60. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's going to be um, three trees I can plant. 1, 2, 3. Actually, that'll do it. Um, get four, four cards. Well, yeah, it's at my expense. <laughs> four cards, none of which I'm keeping. Um, this becomes heat. Gain four plants. These two titanium. It's not going to matter. I'm not keeping any cards. Um, four energy. Not going to do anything for me. A lot of this income. But hey, turn 14, I'm going to make it happen. Spending eight plants for a forest. Right here, which gives me two plants back. And raise the oxygen and raise my TR. The other solo variant is to try to get to TR 63, which I'm kind of close to, but I only need two more plants, which costs 46 total. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. And some change, placing two more of these. Oops. Giving me two plants, three plants. And raising this twice, raising this twice. And I will spare <laughs> everybody else the humiliation. I, I did on turn 14. Um, it would have it would have been 12. Um, I would have been gen Yeah, dive man. Thanks for the heads up. I can't believe I didn't remember that. But this has been a lot of fun, guys. Uh, I appreciate you watching, hanging in there. Um, Puma, thank you so much. We got to have Puma Town. That's going to be this gold one because he's been there from the start of the game. And. Uh, Yeah, well, I, I, uh, I can't commit to any streams at the moment only because we don't have a studio. No. Just, so have a good night. See you next week. Yeah. Next week, you know? uh, next week is I hopefully have a new computer. Um, <laughs> so uh, check out, you know, just follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook page. I usually announce what I'm doing by the weekend. So have a great night, everyone, and I will see you at the next boardroom meeting.